Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. It's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. things running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with both feet, Peter. It's not all about his finishing, though. He's always on the shoulder, looking for that ball in behind, and that prevents the opposition defence from getting too high or indeed getting too comfortable. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. Thrust towards the front line. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Now it's Lewandowski. Face to face with the keeper. Barcelona! First blood drawn! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Barcelona go ahead, one goal to the good. No surprise at all that this is the guy who's had such a positive impact. Well, not only can a player of such high caliber show the imagination to set up a goal, but he can also produce when the pressure's on to deliver a big moment. This guy was born to create. Field. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Yeah, I think the problem there was that the pass was was telegraphed. An easy read for the defence. Played out to the wing. With a delicate ball. That's gone a long way up and away. De Jong. Now it's Lewandowski. Lewandowski unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Roberto. Barcelona are experts at this stylish possession-based game. Well, we're talking tiki-taka. Uh, a lot of short, crisp passing and, and once the ball is lost, they quickly try to win it back. Played into the middle. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Keeper's got good distance on that. And it's Raphael. Lewandowski. Looks like a good ball through. It's hit the upright. Oh, surely that deserved better. He was so quick off the mark there, read the ball beautifully. If only he could have found a half-decent finish. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, he went at it with great confidence, and it's not going to stop him from trying again. Busquets tries to get it forward quickly. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Really well taken goal. And with that goal comes comfort. 
Lewandowski. Versus the keeper, and only one winner. Oh, that's excellent composure because the keeper put as much pressure on as he could by not committing sooner. Barcelona have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal is such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Kessier. Sergio Busquets. Roberto, Dion, Lewandowski, Jordi Alba, Sergio Busquets, out to the left it goes, it's come through and he's had a quick look inside, and back out it comes, Kessier, We've reached half time. Some first half thoughts? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B, and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done. But that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Good challenge. He just stood firm. Tries a through ball. Chance! Ronaldo is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Well, he could end up like a lost sheep, Peter, because they're trying to shepherd him everywhere he doesn't want to go. De Jong. Sergio Busquets. Jordi Alba. Rafael. And it's Lewandowski. Now the pass. Raphael. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Play for a throw. Piquet. Kessier, Sergio Busquets, good defending there, they've slammed the door in the faces of the opposition. Ronaldo has got himself a free kick, and that's going to be a booking. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play, and uh, it makes even less sense. to get it away Kessier 
Christensen De Jong Kessier well positioned to make that interception gets it back now it's Musa. Lewandowski De Jong with the ball through Lewandowski beats the offside trap Cristiano Ronaldo Kessier proves too strong there passes it through Raphael the shot's on and he's there to hoof it away Cristiano Ronaldo Sergio Busquets Moussa looks to thread it through De Jong and it's De Jong looks to slip it through Roberto tries to stroke it through Cristiano Ronaldo and it time is up and there goes the whistle well this hurts the pain of defeat very evident and there are hard lessons to be learned from it all when they regroup how would you summarize what we've seen today then Jim look at the beginning of this 